Hey, what's up, YouTube land? It's your boy, Eddie Hill, the Pennsylvanian toy collector himself. And it's time for another Eddie Hill review. It's review time, people. And today we will be reviewing a Transformer from Generation 1, More Than Meets the Eye. Before we look at the figure itself, I'm going to get a little montage going, because it's Generation 1, Bombshell, why wouldn't I do a montage? <laughs> it's the funnest thing I do on this channel. Give me a second to find the video in my history. <sighs> Oh, sorry, a little bit of a commercial before the video. Here we go. The song from Generation 1. That's all there is for the montage. It was pretty short, if I do say so myself. But now we're going to look at Bombshell himself. And we got him in his bug mode. On my original Generation 1 toy I got from Steel City Con, he has some looseness on the, uh... on a Cerebro Shell thing. So sorry about that in advance. He's just a little bit old and loose. But that's all there is to say for bug mode. He does roll a little bit because they put wheels on him. If you want to do that. But now we're going to get down to bug mode comparison. With my first bombshell. With my Combiner Wars bombshell. G1 Combiner Wars. This one is the better bombshell, and this one is a good-looking G1 toy. But now we're going to get down to transformation, which is simple. Fold that down. Fold the arms out. Fold down the legs. Straighten them out. I'm sure he's got some hollow leg syndrome. On my copy, the eyes were silver. So I went and took a red Sharpie and customized the eyes. So this is my first ever little custom job on a Generation 1 toy. And man, does he look mean with those red eyes. But now we're going to give him his gun. I don't have his Generation 1 gun, which is a shame, really. But now we're going to get down to comparison with Combiner Wars Bombshell. And these Insecticons were mean and gruesome. As soon as I get them transformed. And here he is next to my Combiner Wars Bombshell. I like it better that I customize the eyes on this one. Now it looks similar to this one and I love it. Not completely, but completely G1 accurate, and I just love that. And Generation 1 and Generation 2 was before my time, but I have the whole series on DVD, and I fell in love with these Generation toys, I, Generation 1 toys I picked up from Still City Con. Would I recommend these, these Generation 1 toys? Yes. They are fun to mess around with and transform. And they are good looking figures for old school generations figures. Pick him up. 
you won't regret it. Maybe you can find them on eBay for like a good price. And that's all there is to say for Bombshell. And this is Eddie Hill. Moving on. And rock on and rock out.